Okay, Michael, here's an old handkerchief of mine. I want you to take the match and light it right down at the bottom. Light it? Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Why isn't it burning? It is burning. Can't you see the flame? Well, the handkerchief isn't burning away. No. Now, I don't oh. want you to try this at home, obviously, right? Well, it's fire, so... Yes, it's fire, and it could be dangerous. Uh, but I wanted, I wanted to do was to illustrate why firemen use water to put out a fire. Here, well. you want to put the matches down here because we'll light it again. Because over here is the mixture that's on the handkerchief. It's a combination of alcohol and water. They dissolve in one another, so it's one uniform sort of mixture. When you put the match to it, you're lighting the alcohol, and the alcohol burns. But well, the water doesn't, obviously. Because the alcohol, why didn't the whole thing burn, though? Well, because the handkerchief, in order to burn, has to get to its kindling temperature, high enough to get it to start to burn. The alcohol burns at a much lower temperature. Oh, then secondly, the water that's left behind prevents the handkerchief from getting hot. So it doesn't burn. So it doesn't burn. And that's why firemen put water on a fire to cool off the fuel so it can't burn. I see. Okay, you got the ready with the match? <laughs> so I think you'll get the idea now. You've seen them burn alcohol, haven't you, in a, uh -huh. in a restaurant with a chafing dish or something? Well, they're using that same idea, but this time I have it on a handkerchief, and you can see why I call it my fireproof handkerchief. That's neat. <laughs> okay.